I'm CJ with Starter Builds, and today I'm going to show you how to get rid of your ugly carpet and change it into this. On Starter Builds. So back to what I was saying. <laughs> Alright, so I've officially removed all the carpet. Now I need to go in and remove this carpet cushion. Then I can start laying down my underlayment. So that will be the next process in this flooring process. What's up guys, CJ here with Starter Bill. Just giving you an update of where I'm at on this basement flooring project. I have officially removed all of the carpet as well as the carpet cushion. So now that we've removed all that, the next thing to do is to remove these little tack strips, I think that's what they're called, along the baseboards that uh, essentially secure the carpet in. So I'm gonna go around and remove those all along the different baseboards. I'm gonna get a nice uh, sweep in as well as collect all the dust up and then we'll be able to lay down this flooring. So stay tuned for the build, guys. What's up guys, CJ here with Starter Builds. It is a cold day here in Ohio, it's about five degrees, and I'm working on the flooring project still. It's coming along. I just have this little area to finish here. Mind you, I've never done flooring. I'm not an expert in home renovations. This is literally like one of my first Starter Build home renovation projects. It's pretty much trial and error at this point, so stay tuned for the rest of the build, guys. The best part about any DIY project is the last part or pieces. I've never done a floor before. I have no experience in home, home renovation, whatever you want to call this. But this video just goes to show you that with a little bit of knowledge, a little bit of planning, and a little bit of imagination, you can do any DIY project that you put your mind to. So. Let's finish off the flooring, guys. If you like this video, give a thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe. Thanks so much for watching. So there you have it. There's the completed floor project. I'm super pumped with how this came out. Let me know if you have any questions or comments or if you feel like tackling this project yourself. It's very DIY friendly.